because you will be very quickly offended. It was pretty bad, but super good show. So anybody out there who wants to see Absinthe, do go see it because it's very, very good. So I'm going to show you some footage from Absinthe. Now, I tried to only shoot footage that was appropriate enough for YouTube, so hopefully this is okay because I do do kind of a burlesque thing, but... Um, Hopefully you guys don't mind it. Hopefully you don't get offended because I did try to use some of their tamer stuff. So here we go with Absinthe. This way you don't see any of that crap.
to the wax museum, like I said. Here are some photos from that. So obviously I took pictures with like Leonardo DiCaprio, Justin Timberlake, Cameron Diaz, um, and a whole bunch of different people, you know, people who I really liked, people who I really don't really like, and some people who it was just fun. And I, what I really liked was that you could actually touch the figures, you could pose them properly, you could, um, some of them, like with the George Clooney, they actually gave you outfits that you could wear with them, so I thought that was great. But yeah, it was just all around a really good time. The, the wax figures are incredibly lifelike. It doesn't translate super well in photos though, which is kind of weird, because I guess they get a bit shiny on the photo, but in real life they looked incredibly real. So if anybody out there ever wants to go to the wax museum in Vegas, please do go. It was a stupid fun time, and um, everybody there was really nice in letting you get your pictures in, and um, it's in the Venetian, so if anybody wants to know where to go see it, it's in the Venetian. It's super, ex like, super cheap to go. It was like $16. So yeah, definitely go. It's a great time. You'll love it. Take a shot. Take a shot. I'm recording. Take a shot. Not, not too savvy. Another thing we did on my birthday was we went to Gordon Ramsay's Steak, which is Gordon Ramsay's new restaurant inside the Paris Hotel. And I have always watched Hell's Kitchen and Kitchen Nightmares and love Gordon Ramsay, so to actually get an opportunity to eat his food was ridiculous. So on my actual birthday for dinner, we went to Gordon Ramsay's Steak. And uh, here's some pictures. So we tried a lot of things, but the best was that I actually got to try the Beef Wellington, which is something that I've watched them serving on Hell's Kitchen for 10 years, and I've always been like, oh my god, I so want to try that. So I finally got to try Gordon Ramsay's Beef Wellington, and it was fantastic. Like, you watch it on the show, and you know it's going to taste amazing, but you don't know how good it's going to taste until you actually taste it. Like, I was actually tearing up from how amazing it tasted. And we stuffed ourselves, like we ate so much. And by the end of it, we didn't even feel full. It was comfortable, but not stuffed and disgusting. So it was great. And at the end of the meal, because it was my birthday, they brought out um, a little sticky toffee pudding for me for my birthday cake, and it was so good. Are you recording right now? Yeah. You gonna blow out the candle? Wait. Go ahead. Definitely recommend going to Gordon Ramsay's Steak. It is not a cheap place to eat, but the prices are okay. Like they're pretty reasonable for what you're getting, and it's an experience. Like I feel bad for vegetarians because they'll never taste this beef Wellington, but you know it is something you need to do before you die if you eat meat. So it's awesome. As for hotels, we stayed at the Aria, which um, was a nicer hotel, and it was, it's a newer, nice hotel, and it's right in the middle of the strip, which is great because we didn't have to walk too far to get anywhere, so we did like one side of the strip one day and one side of the strip the other day, it was great, um, and uh, because it was my birthday, they actually bumped us up to a nicer room with like a, with like a view of the strip, and they even for my birthday surprised me in the morning with chocolate and coconut covered strawberries and coconut cake bits. So that was fantastic. It tasted so good, and it was such a good way to start my birthday morning. So that was fantastic. So thank you, Aria. I had a great time. Yeah, other than that, it was just really, really fun, great birthday, and I'm really happy that I got to go, and I'm really happy I got to share it with you guys, so thanks for watching, I hope you liked the video, thank you for everybody on Facebook who sent me happy birthdays, I really appreciated it, and um, I guess I'll try to see you next week with another video, so thanks you guys, bye! I am a very stylish girl.